you again. Real quick little video that I want to share with you guys. Um, I'm on my way to get my daughter from school. It's a half a day today, so early release, whatever they want to call it. So she's out at around 11.15. I figure I'll go now and get her, you know, and get it out the way. But I just want to let you guys know, because I mean, I made a video earlier, um, I guess last week, about once you've changed a habit, once you've, <laughs> or if something works for you, not to mess with it. Um, so I went to get my eye exam probably a month or so ago. Got my eye exam and I thought to myself, you know what, let me go ahead and try contact, see how that works. And then I'm going to still have my glasses in the back up. So, basically, I um, started the trial of the contacts. Um, getting them in was fine. Getting them out was a little struggle. Finally, mastered getting them out. Um, then, I know she mentioned that I had dry eyes when I first went in for my examination. And so, I was like, okay, but I've never really had any issues um, with my dry eyes. So, we didn't make a big deal out of it. So, I wore my contacts um, the first week. I was like, oh, I'm blinking a lot just to clear it, this, that, whatever. They gave me some drops to my eyes. That's supposed to be moisturizing drops or lubricating drops or whatever. So, started using the drops, put it in before I have to actually put the contacts in. And it was fine. Then it was just like very irritated. Went for like a checkup again. And basically she said I had some my like, glands on the here on the bottom of my eyes um, I guess were irritated or whatever it is um, like you know like when she she went ahead and she squeezed them and she's like when she squeezed them it was supposed to be like a, like a clear um, clear kind of discharge or whatever it is but mine was a little murky or whatever never had that issue with my eye before I for one thought to myself you know what I know I said I'm going to try the contacts, but I know messing with your eyes, putting stuff in your eyes, this, that, whatever, I know that's an issue. That can cause issues. Even though you wash your hands, even though you're making sure this keep clean, this, that, whatever. Because a girlfriend of mine was telling me, oh, she gets a lot of infection, a lot of eye infection when she had her contacts. So I was like, nah, I'm going to try it to see how it works. So anyway, they decided to give me some kind of clear care solution. Um, so I guess they're figuring that I need to clean the contacts more, you know, this, that, whatever. Um, and I was like, okay, I'll try it. But before that, actually, they said in order for me to kind of help with my, with the inflammation of my, under my eyes, to try and put like a hot compress on my eye and then kind of do some kind of pressure or whatever it is to kind of squeeze out whatever is in the bottom of my eyelids. So I said, how much is that one compress? 50 bucks. 50 bucks I don't have to waste I said you know why can't I just wet a rag and <laughs> put a hot rag on my face well you have to keep it a certain temperature this that whatever all in all I don't have 50 bucks to waste I was like you know what I'll try I'll try something at home or I'll see it on Amazon see if Amazon has it so anyway I got it this morning after my appointment yesterday and um, you're supposed to soak your contacts in the solution for at least six hours um, so I soak it when I go to bed um, because I go to bed I get to get in bed probably around 9 o'clock and I figured that would be more than enough time to soak them overnight because you're supposed to do it at night anyway so I did that got this morning you know took my shower worked out got on the treadmill did my thing <sighs> attempted to put the contacts in so I put the contact in my right eye it was like I put hot sauce in my eye burning i'm blinking i'm blinking <laughs> i'm like what the hell what the hell is going on I'm trying to get them out like i said i haven't perfected getting them out you know quickly all the time but i've worked my way up where i don't have to do five six tries so i'm trying to get it out trying to get out first second try i can't get out uh, meanwhile it's burning the hell out of me finally get it out and my eyes are pink well my eye is pink and i didn't put the left one in yet it's pink and it's freaking irritating so i was like you know what I'm not gonna do contacts today. Lo and behold, I decide not to do contacts today. I'm driving my daughter to school this morning. I can't see shit. Excuse the language. 
my eyesight wasn't that bad to begin with I just got here um, I pretty much needed it for probably close-up or whatever it is so when I took the contacts out and I know folks are gonna be like oh well, your eyes got adjusted this that whatever no my eyes weren't this bad before I had the contacts I guess your eyes become dependent on them but I still was able to read the street signs when I drove girl I got to a corner couldn't see the street sign and this is after two weeks of wearing the contacts so I'm thinking to myself then maybe these contacts were pretty much making my eyes worse than they were um, and I mean I was I I can see pretty good with the contacts so maybe now that my eyes are used to being you know it weakens my actual vision and that's how I feel and I'm sure that I'm correct so all in all at that spent I already bought you know solution to wash them I already bought the drops again for my eyes I spent some money on them whatever it is and I'm now I'm like I'm not wearing them I refuse so I have no contacts in right right now I'm just gonna wait for my glasses to come and basically I'm just going to use my glasses when I need to like for instance I don't need them to drive in the daytime I can probably put them on when I drive at night when I'm at work if I need to see something that's that small print whatever I I am not going to wear something that's gonna I feel like it's gonna eventually blind me I mean folks are gonna have their opinions that's fine I would like to hear them what I'm saying for me it didn't work <sighs> and uh, that's pretty much what I, what I have to share with you today. I'm not doing contacts. I find my eye has cleared up, but I was I was traumatized this morning. That's how bad it was burning. So another test, another fail. I'm not gonna be bothered with the contacts. I'm just gonna leave them alone. I don't know. I may come back to them some other time, but right now, don't like it. Alrighty, I'll talk to you guys later. Spring break is on its way Wednesday. I got a week off. I got two more days to go. And so far, I haven't done anything with my time but pretty much work out and take my daughter to school. So, we'll see. I'll talk to you guys later. Let me know. I mean, if you wear contacts and you have something to, to you know, input something to tell me, something to share that you think will probably help with my experience where I did something wrong, let me know. But right now... Mm -mm. Not based on the fact like I felt I put hot, like hot sauce in my eyeball. Uh-uh. All right, guys. Talk to you later. Bye.